Okay, so this is how you use a, uh, a padlock shim. Now on our cutaway padlock here, you can see the little levers here and here that go into the, uh, the curved bar here. And if I was to put something in here and push, you can see you can actually push that back and forward like that. So the idea of a shim is uh, if I just remove these rubber seals, put them up and out of the way, uh, you can put the shim down here and I'm just going to put this down while I wedge this in because it's a two-handed job. I'll push all, that, all the way down in there. And then you should see that this bar here, I can focus on this part. Too close to the camera, there we are. So you can see now this part here is actually pushed down. The shim has come down through here and pushed this bar across. So you do the same on the other side and then in theory you can pop the uh, padlock off. But be warned, this doesn't work with all padlocks. Some padlocks, just get this out, are very, very tight around here. The better made it is, the harder it's going to be. So for example here, uh, here's another type of padlock. There's a, a little bit of space around here and there's a tiny bit of space around here, but there's no space to go in, then the shims won't actually go down inside. So uh, yeah, this one will probably pop down there and one in there and then you pop it open. Uh, it's not a tried and tested method. It doesn't work every single time. It's, it's kind of a, an 80% 80, 80 hit whether it'll work or not, but uh, that is how to use a padlock shim.